Queen's Indian Defense, Fianchetto, Nemzoitsk Variation, Quiet, Czech Variation, Intermezzo Line, 7.BG2C68.BC3D5. Balanced neither player ever had an advantage. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. That was an incredible middle game by both players. Opening with the Queen's Pawn. The Indian game begins by controlling the important e4 square with the knight, rather than a pawn. By taking control of the crucial d5 square and creating a space on which the knight can move to c3 without obstructing the c-pawn, move c4 helps to create a strong center. The move e6 creates a line for the dark squared bishop, sets up a rapid castle, and prepares to push a pawn to d5 and recover the piece if it is taken. Nf3 develops toward the center, putting pressure on the e5 square and adding another defender to the d4 pawn. The Queen's Indian defense prepares to fianchetto the light squared bishop on b7, where it will have influence on the long diagonal. The light squared bishop is getting ready to be fianchetto on g2, where it will be positioned on the long diagonal. ba6 immediately attacks the undefended c4 pawn, hoping to provoke b2-b3. b3 protects the c4 pawn and prepares to fianchetto the dark squared bishop to b2, where it will sit on the long diagonal. BB4 plus develops the bishop and puts the white king in check. BD2 develops the bishop, blocks the check and offers an exchange of dark squared bishops. B7 retreats the dark squared bishop after achieving the goal of misplacing white's dark squared bishop on D2, which would much prefer to be B2. Fianchetto move BG2 places the bishop on the long diagonal. The D5 pawn drive is prepared by C6 which also controls the d5 and b5 squares. bc3 moves the bishop to a square that supports the d4 pawn and opens up the d2 square. As it moves into the center, d5 engages the c4 pawn in combat. The pawn is now adequately defended. This develops a knight from its starting square, activating it. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling kingside tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. Castling develops a rook, while also moving the king to safety. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent tends to lead to less sharp positions as compared with opposite side castling. This hits in the middle and prevents the opponent from gaining ground. This strikes at the center with a pawn, fighting for space. It is the last book move. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. This is an equal trade. It is best. Backs off. It is ideal. This accomplishes this by posing a threat to a rook and compelling it to flee. It is quite good. The rook is now on a square that is more secure. That's good. This pins a pawn which restricts its mobility. It is ideal. This reveals an attack on a bishop. It is excellent. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. It is quite good. Recaptures. It is ideal. This exchange is fair. That's good. This comes in several sections. That's good. The rooks are linked by this making it easier for them to work together in the future. It is ideal. This captures a vulnerable pawn. It is best. That is a logical response. It is quite good. Now that the rooks can see one another, they can defend one another. It is quite good. By moving a rook from its starting square, this activates it. It is ideal. Now that the rook is on an open file, it is easier to control squares all over the board. It is ideal. A solid choice. It is excellent. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. It is excellent. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. Backs off. It is ideal. This is not the best. It is an inaccuracy. This offers an equal trade of pieces. It is best. Balanced neither player ever had an advantage. 
that game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. That was an incredible middle game by both players. This is an equal trade. It is excellent. Balanced neither player ever had an advantage. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. That was an incredible middle game by both players.